Hi. This is the Behringer ADA8200. It looks like an 8-channel audio interface, but it's not an audio interface. You can't use it as a standalone device for recording. However, you can use the Behringer ADA8200 by connecting it to an audio interface, which also has digital in and out. And you can expand the number of inputs of your audio interface by using ADAT connection. My audio interface is the Antelope Audio Discrete 4 Synergy Core and has four inputs. So I can only record four audio signal sources at a time. For example, two guitars, a bass guitar, and a vocal. However, when I connect a Behringer ADA8200, the number of inputs increases to 12, so I can record larger musical ensembles at once. I'll show you how to connect your audio interface to this Behringer device. So this down below is my Antelope Discrete 4 audio interface, and above is the Behringer Ultra Gain. To sync both devices, I need to determine which device is the master and which is the slave. Since I want my Antelope audio interface to be the master word clock for this digital recording system, I'm going to set this little slider on the Behringer device to the slave position. The Behringer ADA8200 can also be the master, in which case I'll move the slider to the right position. But in my case, the master will be the Antelope audio interface. So I'll set the Behringer as slave. Now I will connect the word clock inputs with a cable. I continue by connecting both devices via digital in and outs or ADAT ports. I will cross connect the in and outs on both devices. Done. Now when I turn on the Behringer device, a sync light comes on. We can see that it is in the locked position, not the master. So everything is as I wanted and the master role is held by the Antelope audio interface. This was a demonstration of how to connect a Behringer ADA8200 to an audio interface via an ADAT connection. Expanding the number of inputs on an audio interface is a very useful option. And I used it, for example, when recording a school ensemble, when I was recording nine instruments and vocals at the same time. The Behringer ADA8200 has served me well, so I recommend it. You need to make sure, however, that your audio interface supports ADAT connectivity as mine does. Thank you for watching. See you next time.